But, well, helmets, medical vlog, it's time to football, helmets, medical vlog. We can, we can, oh. Yes. Yes. Did you like how I remixed it at the end? <laughs> oh, I am cool. Welcome to Dr. Football Helmet's Medical Vlog, another vlog uh, from certified medical professional Dr. Football Helmet. Um, I have a medal around my neck, that's so you know I'm certified, just in case you're watching for the first time and you want to be sure I am uh, I'm actually legitimate. I understand your concern and I understand why you'd want to make sure that I know what I'm doing. And I guarantee you can ask anyone who watches this channel regularly. I do know what I'm doing. Today, I'm going to talk about a topic that I feel is very important that not enough medical professionals uh, talk about, and that is losing weight. Um, it, everyone wants to lose a few pounds. Um, I know I've had it in the past where I, I've looked at myself in the mirror and I've said, Oh, you're putting on a few pounds there, doctor. Uh, <laughs> you gotta, you gotta um, lose the weight. So, um... I'm going to be talking about that today. Now, a lot of medical professionals who do address this issue will say things like, oh, you have to eat healthy. You have to eat a lot of celery and carrots and rutabagas and sweet corn and oranges and strawberries and cherries and blueberries and lemons and oranges. I think I said oranges twice. Um, but then they'll say that all that all that stuff, and all that stuff is yummy, and I will admit, I do eat um, some of that fruit from time to time. Of course, it's hard to get it through the face mask, so I don't eat as as much as I, you know, normally would. And mostly, I just um, if I'm going to eat fruit, I'll blend it up and put it in a smoothie, and then I'll um, get the straw through the face mask, and it, it makes it very easy. I actually eat a lot of my food that way because um, I never take off my helmet because if I did, I would die. So. Um, that's that's just a little sidebar about myself, and that was. But, but the point is, they say that you should eat a lot of healthy foods to lose weight, and I'll tell you what, I've eaten a lot of healthy foods in my time, a lot of uh, grapes and and papayas and, and watermelons, cantaloupe, muskmelon, tomatoes, cucumbers. Peas, uh, grapes. I think I might have said grapes twice. Uh, but uh, yes, I, I'll eat all of those. I, I don't, I don't see the results. I don't lose a ton of weight. Um, so I, I, don't, I don't buy into that. Sure, they're yummy, but they won't. That's not the key to losing weight. That is not the key. Other medical professionals will say you need to get a lot of exercise to lose weight. They'll say you need to go running and jogging and. And you need to do a sport of some sort, like the basketballs or the football. And I agree with the football part, because they wear football helmets, at least for a little bit. And then we'll take them off. I'll just get so angry and I'll throw stuff at the TV. Sorry. Getting a little sidetracked again. Uh, they'll say you should, you know, do some sit-ups and some pull-ups and some jumping jacks. All that stuff. And I'll tell you, I've done that from time to time. I'll do a sit up here and there, and I'll go go for a little jog from my from my door front door to the to the mailbox to get the mail. Um, well, I don't see many results from that either. I tell you, it, 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 I look at the scale after I do my my quick jog there, and I, it doesn't seem to work. I'll go um, for a little walk from my pantry to uh, my bedroom and. I have a Fitbit that I have, uh, a friend gave me for Christmas one year, and uh, I wore it for a little while there and it counted my steps, and I got up to a good 100, 120, <sighs> didn't see any results on the scale, so I just threw that Fitbit away, and I've, I just, I don't buy into the fact that you have to be active to lose weight. So, neither of those things are, are uh, are what I would suggest. Here's what I, Dr. Football Abbott, would suggest you, you do if you want to lose weight. <sighs> Put on your exercise gear. Whatever you, whatever you usually wear. You know, shirt, 
underwear, shorts, shoes, socks. The normal, you know, if you wear some, some bands around your arms, yeah, go ahead. Um, and, you know, uh, put some eye black on under your eyes if you want to, to get serious about whatever, you know. All that, that fitness gear is fine. Put it all on. Or don't! Pfft, see what I care. You, you can put on a suit. You can put on a, a, a shirt and a tie. It, it doesn't matter what you wear. That's what I'm not trying to say. None of that. You could be stark naked for all I care. Go, go, go ahead. Just take off all your clothes. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Just don't, you know, don't go, like, if you're in public, don't do that, because uh, I've had, you know, just, you could get arrested or whatever by the feds. But the one thing you do need to wear, and I hope you are taking notes, the one thing that you need to wear to lose weight is a hockey mask. <laughs> Psych! That's not right! I think I did I get you? I think you uh, did you start writing down hockey mask? Oh, I think I got some of people out there. It's not a hockey mask, it is a football helmet! Of course it's a football helmet. Football helmet is the key. By wearing a football helmet, you will lose weight. And let me tell you why. I don't think I've gone a day in my life where my head has not sweated profusely due to this thing. It's very tight on my head. And I sweat like a dog. I sweat so much. And the sweat I lose where it, while wearing this thing, especially in hot weather, is how I lose weight. I lose a lot of water weight by wearing this football helmet. And not only that, the football helmet also helps me to lose weight in other areas of my body. It, it does so through psychological manipulation. Uh, that's a big that's a big phrase I just used and I I'll give you a second to write it down. Did you get it? Good. Okay. So psychological manipulation. The helmet communicates to the rest of the body that you care about fitness. It tells your body Oh, look at this guy. He's wearing a football helmet. He must be a fit guy. And it con it convinces your body to say, oh, look at all this fat I've got. I've got some fat. Got some fat around my thighs and my gut. I don't need this fat. This fat is useless because this football helmet is so much better than uh, being a fat slob. And it just, it just, it, it whips yourself into shape. You you will, uh, you may not believe me. You may this may sound too good to be true. The fact that you just put on a football helmet and then lose like fifty pounds in three days, it happens. It happens. Your body adjusts. Trust me. Try it. It happened for me. I I wish I could show you a before picture, but I don't have one. Before I put this thing on, I was three hundred and fifty pounds. Poor. I was a big fat slob. But then, I put this thing on, and I was down to 210 pounds. And that, and that, oh, that was like five days. Five days I lost all that weight. It was just tremendous. And I know I said before, 50 pounds in three days. That's, that's an average. I was above average. I was a, a miracle. Uh, people from the university wanted to do uh, studies on me. That's how cool it was. It was like... It was like Jared, but on steroids. Oh, I shouldn't say Jared. He was a, uh, it was like a guy who lost a lot of weight on steroids. Yes, uh, we'll cut Jared out of here. Anyway, um, yeah. So that's really all I have to say about that. Put on a football helmet, you'll lose. Uh, could lose 150 pounds. It's pretty cool. And then don't worry, if you are 150 pounds, that doesn't mean you will cease to exist. It doesn't, it doesn't work like that. You won't, you won't devolve into nothing. Uh, that would be bad. No, you'll just lose some, you'll lose a good amount of weight for your, your body type. Alright. Well, I think I covered that pretty well. I hope you enjoyed um, this talk, and I hope you will uh, 
do a little putting on my helmet and and lose some of that dang that dang flab. All right. See you next time.